What's up friends of the internet? So welcome back to the Jube Tube. Today we're going to be talking about Pokemon Tournament DX for the Switch. I do know that it's already out for the Wii U, but with different controllers, different capabilities with the system, I downloaded the demo and here are my first impressions of how everything's going. So since it is a demo, I am doing a first impressions video because lots of stuff can change potentially since it is already out i don't know how much weight this will hold as a review because they're probably setting their ways so i did download the demo this week i played it a little bit i streamed with it last night played with it maybe about an hour or so um, but it is limiting it only gives you 15 matches before the demo ends so i wanted to play as much as i could save a little bit for when i want to play it before it comes out and, and dive back in it does come out end of September, September 28th range, somewhere in there. So I just want to give some thoughts on what I think about the game. First and foremost, it's fun. You know, it scratches that nostalgic itch. Uh, people like me who played Pokemon Stadium back in the day, this is very similar. I enjoy that, but it's got better graphics, right? So it, it's good. Um, I feel like a kid when I'm playing it, it it's fun. Now, you do only get Charizard, Pikachu, and Empoleon, I think is his name. I was out of it by the time that character came along. I don't know when that was. So, as far as characters go, you don't get a lot. Also, the roster is pretty small. I think it's a little weird that there was about 21 Pokemon, I think it was. Two were repeated. Pikachu got two, and Mewtwo got two, which is odd. Like I feel like those would be skins or suits, like in most other fighting games. They are separate characters here, which is odd. I mean, I would assume maybe they've got a different move set, but it's weird. I don't like that. I mentioned that they've got better graphics, yes, but at the same time, it's still Nintendo. So some of it, I felt, was repetitive. Some of the characters had textures in themselves that were repeated in other characters that were different kinds of characters so if it was charizard who's like a reptile or a lizard if that's repeated in mewtwo if it looks similar with how the lights hit in it that texture that's a little different mewtwo's not a lizard some of that felt a little off other things looked really good lucario's fur looked good pikachu looked pretty good but it, it did seem almost last gen level of graphics be, but it's the switch it's nintendo so that's that's to be expected i'm not expecting you know, ridiculous God of War level, like God of War 4, Uncharted, or these ridiculous games, or Hellblade I recently just played, like those graphics were phenomenal. I'm not expecting that, so I don't hold that against them. The roster thing is a little upsetting that I would assume, I mean, a lot of them look to be fan favorites, and then you have Chandelure or whatever that was. Seems kind of odd to toss that in the mix. I feel like the roster is a little weak. As far as gameplay goes, I also feel it's a little weak. I enjoy myself, I'm not playing against other people, so I don't get a real feel for that because I would assume you toss in a real person would be different. It is also a demo, so I can't change difficulty, and I'm sure it gets harder as the game goes on, but this is a true story. My two and a half year old son won with Pikachu. Like he legitimately was able to beat the opposite, the opposing character in the demo with Pikachu if that tells you how difficult this is. It's a button mash style game. You get spoiled. I really enjoy what NetherRealms has done with uh, Mortal Kombat, with Injustice, that fighting style, what they've done with that, I feel is very fluid. It works very well. Not to say that this is bad or wrong, but it is a arcadey button mash style of combat. There's no like down forward X to do the ice ball from Sub-Zero. There's none of that. There is just, this does this kind of attack, this button does this kind of attack, you press this button to jump. Which, by the way, a button to jump is very, very odd to get used to. Up has been jump in fighting games for as long as I can remember, so it's, it's very weird to have that. It's not a traditional fighting style game, it is a button masher. I mean, if my, if my son can beat it, it is a demo, so I'm sure it's easy, but come on. Even with Injustice, I've got to put it on training mode so the other guy won't fight back because he just wants to be Batman. Because he won't win on the easiest setting. This here, he, he won handily. His Pikachu, he rocked him. He did good. Again, it's fun. It's not a bad game. 
but there are definitely some things that I would improve upon. The combat, the character list, the, the move sets, um, along with the gameplay, you know what I mean? Like, because you could have the Mortal Kombat style, but just not be good at it. What they're doing, they're good at it, but I just don't enjoy it. I don't think I'm the demographic. I think the demographic is that middle tier, which is good. That's fine. You're hitting a wider audience that way. I'm sure when I get on there and I can play against people or maybe there's a story mode or maybe it will increase if there are tournaments, that's fine. I'm sure it will get more difficult, so it will be more challenging for me. But they also have to make it for kids that like Pokemon. They can't make it too difficult, so they can't pass anything. So they're hitting that middle tier. Overall, I would say it's fun. I probably will buy it because, again, it did scratch that nostalgic itch. I'm, I'm, I'm old enough now that I'm not in the embarrassed stage to be like, no, I don't play that. People will make fun of me. Like, this is, it's fun. It's fun. It's a fighting style game. It reminds me of Pokemon Stadium. It reminds me of my childhood. I feel good playing it. I, I can't be not happy playing it. So, it, it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. Um, I look forward to the full game. Hopefully, some things will be, you know, some corners will be rounded. Some things will be smoothed out. You know what I mean? I hope so. I still say if you've got a Switch, download the demo, play the 15 matches at the very least. It's free. If you like Pokemon, if you played it as a kid, play it in secret. Who cares? Enjoy it. I enjoy it. I think it's fun. So that's my first impressions. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you've played the demo, let me know your thoughts. Am I being a little harsh with how I've critiqued this in the sense of textures and stuff? Am I overthinking things? Let me know. As always, guys, share this with the world. Give me a like. I appreciate you. And I'll see you guys again next time.